today we're going to be learning how to do the trick Underbird Pressure Axe. Before learning this trick, you should already know how to do underbird, axe, and any sort of basic pressure trick as recommended. So let's start off with the first part, underbird. When you land underbird, you'll want to make sure the tama is as locked onto the stall point as possible. This will help a lot when doing the pressure movement. Also make sure to use a well broken in tama for this trick, as it will make things a little easier. Now let's move on to the pressure move. Place the tama on underbird and quickly move the can up until it's in the axe position. Then reset and do this again. This will help you get a feel for the pressure mechanic, which is a little tricky to understand at first. Notice how I'm moving the can quickly up so that the tama stays put without falling off. Do this until you feel the tama is staying put when doing the pressure movement. Now we can move on to the final part, catching it into axe. After you've done the pressure part and the spike of the can is pointing up, you want to catch the tama and axe. This is how my hand placement is when holding an axe. My thumb is below the bevel to avoid contact with the can, and my other fingers wrap around the back side of the tama. Once you catch it in axe, you can do a simple fall in, but it's really up to you. That's the trick. Hope you guys found it helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.